Women rank five men by attractiveness. Let's have a look. Let's see what we got here. What are we working with? Fun fact, I got an email to be in this video, but I was too busy. Hey guys. What's up? What's up? How's everyone doing? Great. Good, how you doing? I'm nervous. doing okay, thanks. Definitely a little nervous. No, God no, I'm so stoked. <laughs> <laughs> All right. All right. Okay, guys. I say the one that's in the middle. Unfortunately, is like, he is fine. Top. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Agreed. Hi. Dude, curly hair just fucking wins, bro. Like, do, do you guys understand why I want curly hair now? We'll start there. To the. Uh, you are good looking. I appreciate that, my friend. Thank Absolutely. you. Do you think women often find you attractive? Uh, yeah. So why? Why Real. did you put him for? I feel like I saw his smile. The smile was nice. He's tall and he's tall, yeah. he has like really nice hair and he's tan. What are you looking for in a man physically? Um, I put Luke Bennett and you came up on my live. That might have genuinely been the worst insult I've ever heard in my life. Luke Bennett. Definitely someone who's tall, taller than me, that's for sure. Definitely good teeth. Says a lot about personal hygiene. If it looks like you haven't brushed your hair in a day or two. Someone with bad hygiene, that's just immediately, you don't take care of yourself and I don't want to be near you. I like smiles, I like eyes and energy. Maybe like demeanor, like how they're standing. I think blue shirt needs to be second or- I agree. Because I agree. His, his face is really symmetrical. Eyes. Yeah. I like Real the eyes, yeah. Second. Yep. Let me just see. Yep. Yeah. Why is your point okay. thingy ninja? What do you mean? Personality. Yeah, he's like unbothered. I really like him. Look at his shirt, guys. Yeah. It's giving Shaggy from Scooby. So I really like. Look him. at the I chain too. Yeah. Jack is giving. Yeah. Like, Jack is giving. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I want to die. I want to cringe so badly, but I'm going to hold myself back. <laughs> yeah, I think I uh, what would you do if Luke Bennett was in your fridge? Do you know what? I was about to... The fact that I was about to do it is insane to me, but I'm not going to do it. I'm better than that. I like a uh, pretty nice face. Like, my Get out! Is really, like, everyone says I got a cute nose. I like this dude. He's quiet and he's here. Yeah. He's just, that's I, true. That's, 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 one of that's my favorite. That's my favorite type of people. I would say that, like, I'm very middle of the road here. I am the only short hair white guy, so that's, like, going to set me out of the group. It's like, oh, the, oh, look, vanilla ice cream right there. I feel like we could leave them how they are. Yeah. Oh, but then, oh, but he went away. He left. He's so cute. This is hard because I feel like Andros is so sweet. Like, I just want to protect him. Like, he yeah. looks like a baby that, yeah. like, I feel like, I don't know. Okay, let's try to switch this one and this one and see how that looks. Which yeah. one? Which one? You, green shirt, to the end. Let's see how that looks. And you switch. Yeah. yeah. How do you guys feel about that? Because style. Um, I, I think Andros is second for me. Yeah. I'll say it again. Yeah. yeah I Honestly, think so. yeah. Ooh, that looked. Oh, wait, wait. Second, wait, no, like no, that no, way? no, no. Yeah, oh, yeah, reverse. Yeah. No. Oh, you guys meant that oh, way. Wait, oh, yeah. This, I, I meant the reverse. That. Oh. So you should we keep him in the middle? Wait, should we keep him in the middle? Like, yeah, let's keep yeah, him in the okay, middle. It's a happy It's getting yeah, average. Okay. Middle ground. Sorry. Okay. I think just like look wise, I think. First impressions. Yeah. Nothing personal. Mm. What's up, Aria? How you feeling, bro? How did you drink some water, you dehydrated fuck? All right. Well, I'm doing good. Thanks. I hope you're doing good too. You feel during the physical round? Uh, I loved it. I loved when people were judging me. It made me feel good. Even though I wasn't at the top, it was just like, yeah, they get to look at me. Love it was also good for them. They got to look at some beauty over here. Uh -uh. Can everyone introduce themselves, name, and what you do? Yeah. Uh, I'm Kai and I model. I'm Wes, I'm a student and model. I'm Andros and I run a tech company. Is that an accent? Damn. Is that an accent? Yeah. yeah. How are you allergic to I'm not allergic to water. I just don't like the taste of water on its own. We've been through this, bro. I like flavored water or orange squash or lemonade or milkshake. That's the way I roll. Uh, what do you think it is? I have no idea, but I like it. <laughs> I'm Jack, I'm an actor and I coach volleyball. Damn. I'm Nick. I'm a painter and a, I make furniture. Cool. Oh. You make, how do you make, like, how do you create a furniture? Wow. Very cool. What are you looking for in a man personality-wise? 
Um, someone who's confident, just like someone who knows who they are. I'm very attracted to humor. Humor, that's 100%. I like someone who's funny and who can take a joke because like, I've had experiences with super serious men who just, they take Flavor everything Flavor Waters, I'm telling you, bro. If I hear any sort of bragging or any Nobody sort knows of, it, though. I've got this, I made more than I don't want it, I already stopped listening. Someone who's cocky, um, I think it's important to be confident, but it's very, there's a very clear distinction between the two. Hey, Grace. What do you find attractive in someone? I mean, personally, I love it when guys care about the quality of products they use. Hmm, I've never actually thought about that, but you know what? It makes sense. When someone cares about the quality of their products and doesn't fall for marketing gimmicks, that's really attractive. Oh my gosh, sorry I'm late. I couldn't help but overhear your conversation. Can I just add cleanliness, specifically a good clean shave? Wait, duh. Of course you can. Okay, perfect. I'm so glad because we want to thank Henson Shaving for sponsoring this portion of the video. During the two. Ale, they replace as long or exclude. Thanks. Um, what's everybody's favorite movie? Everything, everywhere, all at once. <gasps> okay. That's a really good one. Tears of the Sun. Okay. It's about um, the war in Africa, how African nations go against each other, and um, oh, wow. U.S. forces went over to save um, some, um, I think it was a princess or a king. What's up, Jay? Really what are those? Time. I don't okay, know what you're on about, mate. He seemed like he was very nervous. That nervous energy was a little bit off-putting, so that energy just didn't match. I would say game What, so you just can't be nervous ever? Death is like an old Bruce Lee movie. It's like the first movie I ever saw with my dad. Wow. I really like the Spongebob movie. <laughs> I watch that like every month. Oh my gosh, yes. Uh, Drive. That's also a good movie. That's a good one. Okay. I'm going to be that person. What's your zodiac sign? We'll be back in a second, boys. I'm a Libra. Okay. I'm a Cancer. Are you just asking for sun or like all oh, oh, okay. okay. stuff? <laughs> <laughs> I'm uh, Eric. Your ass is gigantic. I th thank you very much. I have been telling people this, but they just don't believe me. Only fans when? Well, I do actually have. Oh, wait, I can't say that. TikTok, I was. My only fan is my best friend. See? I'm so smart. I'm so smart. I can't even say that. Sag Moon, Taurus Rising. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, I'm Sagittarius, but my sister knows all the other stuff. The Rising. Mm. It's all my fault. Once you said Sagittarius, I was good. Uh, <laughs> I'm a. Uh, what am I? Wait, let me check my Snapchat because my Snapchat tells me. What am I again? I think I'm a. I think I'm an Aries. No, I'm not. I'm a Taurus. I'm a Taurus. I don't give a shit to I'm be honest. Sagittarius. Fire Sagittarius. Kidding. That was crazy. Uh, I'm an Aquarius, oh. and then I think I have like. Gemini somewhere or okay. Libra. Should we have something deeper? Like, should we go deep? When's the last time you cried? Yeah. I was watching. Ooh, when was the last time I cried? It's been, it's been maybe nearly a year, to be honest. Um, I, I don't remember. Medication commercial. Actually, no, that's a lie. I think the last time I cried a little bit was on my birthday. Or like a few days before my birthday because I got a really nice message from my viewers. So for uh, like back pain and this woman was like in a hospital bed. I'm a Gemini. That's why I cheat on girls and have to talk to multiple women at the same time. That is insane. But like, good luck to you. <laughs> this is so sad. Oh my God. Yeah. So I cry at commercials and yeah. Last time I cried was Marley and me. Oh I can't do that. If I ever see a yeah. I'm complete. Uh, I watched this film called Past Lives recently, yes. and it's, yeah, I cried at the end scene. It was, when was the last time you guys cried, crazy. chat? Now we have to watch it. Yeah, oh. you do. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's trying to cry now? No, I lost my best friend this year, so it's still been a hard thing for me. Yeah. I'm so sorry. Oh, I'm sorry. Like you made me think about it. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Oh, wow. Oh, oh my god. Oh, oh, can fuck. we give him a hug? Wait, yeah. is that allowed? Can we get, give him a group hug? Oh my gosh. <laughs> Group I'm hug? so sorry. Okay. It's fine. Oh, that's so deep, bro. Oh, I feel so bad. Get so the bad. tissues. Oh my god. Oh, I'm so sorry, man. Man, it's hard. I'm not gonna joke. Yeah, oh that was my brother. Oh. oh fuck. Damn, whose question was that? No, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> And you? Oh, mine was like, I think last week. I think it was at the movies. I was watching a movie. Okay. Well, like, Which one? The stupidest reason. It's Blue Beetle. He looks a bit like Sneeko, like in the face. Does anyone else see it? 
it had something to do with family, oh. and I just made me cry <laughs> so hard. That makes sense. I was like, damn. And I cried like three times in that movie, I think. <laughs> I just respect them. <laughs> Okay, what's your um what's your body count? Oh Okay. Oh, if there's anything above ten, then that's insane. I've got one though. <laughs> My, mom's My mom's gonna, gonna watch, watch this. Yeah. Thirteen. Okay. Bro said thirteen and they're like, oh yeah, alright. What? What do you mean? Oh, I think 10. Okay. I think I'd, you know, I don't want to think of each one as like a number. So, yeah. Okay. I'm not going to answer that question. Oh, okay. Big number then. Okay. I want to keep that private. Pete, back off his answer. Oh, shit. I'm sorry to hear that, Aria, bro. I'm Double sorry. Trick. Okay. Lost Shack is a crazy response. Yeah, I mean, that's all. I didn't, I never, I never, I never counted this. I never kept, like, he's like, when you said, I never kept track of this. So at the point, I never actually counted in my head. So Bro, so now. In my head, mentally, now I'm counting, okay. <laughs> Nick, you've been reacting back I'm there. Been is it bad that I haven't cried at someone's funeral? No. It's interesting. You don't have to cry. What, what was your reaction when he didn't want to think of everyone as a number? Uh, I would like to ask you when the last time you got <laughs> tested for anything was. Me? Yeah, just out of safety, dude. Like, keep track. March. 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 Okay, yeah. there you go. I'm just saying, that's what I thought. I was like, what the f heck? <laughs> no, no, sorry. It's, no, people are people and not just numbers, obviously. But yeah. I was just, I'm just saying like, all right. Yeah, well, it's better, much better. I got to keep track in my head because I forget things all the time. Yeah. So it was okay. a little bit dramatic for me. Um, and that was coming from the quiet guy. So it was just kind of confusing. Um, I'm kind of with that. You should get tested. I mean, I think the delivery kind of came out a little harsh. I didn't mean to impart any judgment upon him for that at all. I was just thinking like, um, it's like, oh, well, I mean, duh, dude, everyone here thinks women are people. Like, I think that's, we all agree. Like, no, they're not just numbers. They're not like wins. But if someone wins? asked me a question, I was thinking like, well, what's the rough answer? <laughs> yeah, sorry. <laughs> totally. Yeah, 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 oh, yeah. We him. <laughs> yeah oh, one. oh, oh, okay. Um, you don't have to say it. No, actually. I don't really care. It's, it's, I don't care. Uh, like 27. That's two people for every single year that I've been alive. And let's just say, for example, that he's 26, right? That's 10 years you've been legal in the UK, right? That's nearly three people a year. 28. Okay. Um, who pays on the first date? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I would. Honestly. Yeah, who I makes would. more money? <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's that's three a year ain't that bad? I don't even talk to one a year! Oh, I think it, it sometimes depends on who invited who, but most of the time it's like in a heterosexual setting, it's like the guy inviting the girl, so. With Andros, I felt like he had direction in his life. He just screamed provider man mindset, and that's something that I'm very attracted to. What do you feel like is something that you struggle with the most that you're like working towards fixing? That has prevented you from like healthy relationships. For real, I'm being for real. I can say I lost myself at one point in my life, um, just going through a lot of hardships, especially with my grandma when she died. I just kind of lost myself in the wild, lost myself in the sauce. But I can definitely say I was toxic to a certain degree a couple years ago. I think mine is more of like asking for help because I grew up an only child until like maybe a couple years ago. And then also growing up, my mom was always working, so I'd come home alone and do everything myself. Like communication is like my number one factor. If like you can't do that, then there's not gonna work here. I think for me- Dude, I love his hair, bro, I can't lie. I tend to dedicate a lot of time at work. And so sometimes I think my ex would say that I neglect them or I don't spend enough time with them. And as I'm getting older, I think I'm realizing that you know, having a healthy relationship actually really helps with your ambitions. You're an Aries. I'm an Aries. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. Uh, when I was young, I was like kind of dumb, and I didn't realize oh, talking bad. and doing stuff with other girls was as bad as it like could be. You know, I didn't cheat or anything. Let's calm down. I saw your face, <laughs> but I was just like, just like you know, like hanging out with girls and not being like vocal about it. I learned that was like pretty bad, and it, like you know, just mess. That would like that's what all my exes would say. I don't know. I definitely like. Um, I get like pretty bad seasonal depression. If you're looking for a relationship, three a year is much. But if you're looking for fun and pl Ari, you are fucking trolling. On my life, you're trolling. Ten a year ain't that bad? 
and I'm like, I'm gonna go crawl into a hole and die. Um, and then I'm not really there for everyone in my life. So working on that. Can't wait to try and find a wife in the future and all they care about is star signs. That is facts, that bro. Like a big thing. That's facts. Is everyone here single? Yes. Yes. For the most part, yeah. How, yeah. <laughs> She's gonna watch no, this. No, she knows. So. Uh, like, we talked about this. I'm, I communicate these things. Do you guys believe in monogamy? Yeah. Yeah? yeah? All to of a certain yeah. extent. Yeah. What is that again? I forgot. With where generation's going, marriage is kind of dying out. You don't need to be married with somebody. It's just like someone that you trust and have a good relationship with that you can build a relationship and it's like... No, I want to get married. Like one person finding another person and they could be together for as long as that happens. And then maybe one day they break up or end things, who knows? It happens, it's realistic. It's just... Okay. Okay, so number one, I said he should be at the front at the beginning. Number two, um, he's very attractive, but he knows it. Number three, funny. I said I like funny guys. Vibed with his looks and his personality and um, his job. Definitely someone I'd actually be interested in getting to know outside of this. I really didn't agree with a lot of his views on stuff, which is fine, like you do you, it's just not for me. And then, like mildly uncomfortable, which is nothing against him. <sighs> yeah. My number one. Nah, I feel bad because they're gonna see this, bruh. Has energy in line with like men that I'm usually attracted to. And number two. Nah, number five. I feel bad for this guy, two, dude. I really think he's very interesting and cool in a way that's not someone that I would usually be attracted to, but I am. And then the bottom, it's not like I dislike anyone. I just. I'm very disinterested in a lot of people, and so I think it's just like, it's just like you guys are cool. So my number one, it's because he's giving a sense of stability, so it's giving like more daddy vibes, and I really like that. Um, number two, it's because he just sounds fun and my vibe, so I think we would get along. And number She's five, cute. it was the exact opposite of why I chose the first one. <laughs> this one, um, because I Damn. can learn a lot from him, and I feel like. I won't get annoyed. Number two, I like the quiet. I like when, you know, men don't have to interject or talk, you know, steal the show. Number four, um, I really appreciated his honesty and vulnerability. Are you enjoying this episode of Ranking? I have West. Tell you. At no. seven points. Wow. In fourth. Yeah, Carla, I don't care about all that. I'll be so honest with you. I told you. What? Kai, you had 13 points. Ooh, love it. In third, Nick. No way. Good job. At 15 Nobody points. Knows. Second, Jack. At 16 points. Wow. Oh, Thank God. And in first, What a Andrew double you. At 24 points. Not bad, bro. Whoa. What? That's a lot. Uh, You'd be my top one too. Crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> what? What? He was tattooed. Really it was everything. No, why? But okay, thank you. That's. Very <laughs> it might be the accent, bro. <laughs> like, yeah. Wait. So it's like nearly the. It's like nearly the opposite, kinda. Yeah, it's low key the opposite of what I predicted, bro. How's everyone feeling? Oh, I feel fine. That's fine. Yeah. I feel better. I'm feeling good. Better. I'm feeling good. The mid white guy made it to the middle. I'm <laughs> oh shit, they're doing it opposite next week. Oh, that's gonna be good. One, and we put Gingers too. All right. Go, go, go. <laughs> keep going, keep going, go. There we go. Yeah. Perfect. Okay, that'll be good. Some questions like about track this and I answered Hey, that it. was a good video, bro. That wasn't too bad. That wasn't too bad. That was pretty good. Okay, we'll watch the next one next week, bro.